The song took you to Sophia Richie's wedding. It did. How crazy She's is lovely. That? She's so great. Oh, that it pays was, well too. It was a star star studded time. Uh, it was cool. It was cool. I mean, it's kind of. It's weird to think about because it's like I again like it's so like I can recognize them as like for for the impact in like culture that they have had with their fame and like you know with Lionel Richie and you know like uh, Cameron Diaz was there I'm like yes I've seen your movies but like you're so normal and like we're just here at a wedding and we're celebrating love and that's so cool like that's so cool and uh gosh I mean it was such a cool favor to have gotten to be a part of that wedding. I mean, I would Wait, have done hold it. hold on. Favor? What are you talking about? It was like, well, okay. So like, uh, yeah, how much did I pay? 50 grand? Plus no, 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 no. It wasn't a, it wasn't a paid <laughs> thing or anything like that. It was a, uh, and I, I would have done it for free. I would not have, would not have gotten paid for that. Would not accept payment for that. Like any moment to celebrate some loving. That's good. That's good. That's good jam. That's I'll keep that in mind. That's good jam. Uh, and obviously the context is a beautiful thing, you know? And so, uh, you're not Lionel Richie. You're not Lionel Richie. So, uh, so <laughs> her husband, uh, her husband, he, he had asked, um, cause, cause his dad, you know, he, he works in the business is a huge Hello? name in business, uh, Lucian Grange. And so, <laughs> and so, and so he, his son knew that, uh, so Sophia loved until I found you and like was playing a lot. And so. He he asked his dad if, if that was possible, and so he way, that's hit me like up. that's your boss's boss's boss. <laughs> yeah. So so the, <laughs> the the main man who is the, the loveliest man. man ever, a great great father, great man, uh, and an icon, and one of the smartest businessmen in music to ever exist, hands down. He, you said it, I Sir mean, Lucian Grange. He like you bad to the guy. Yeah, I mean he uh, so he reached out to us and he. <laughs> He asked a favor. He was like, "Would you would you come and be part of the wedding? Would you come and sing the song?" And I was like, "Done, of course. Are you kidding me? Yeah." And so uh, he flew us out uh, to Nice, and, uh, and we were there for I mean two days. We were there for two days and uh, sang the song. And uh, I remember um, Elliot went down to go meet uh, Sophia down down the aisle, and uh, he was like, "Do you do you uh, do you see who's over my shoulder singing the song?" She was like, oh, I, I don't know. And uh, she looked over her shoulder and it was it was me singing the song. And obviously we replaced Georgia with Sophia, and uh, which was asked for, which was a great idea. And uh, she just lost it. And so she she was there for a while. And so we kept having to sing like the chorus over and over again because she was crying, you know. And so she was having to like get ready, you know, and she was having like a wardrobe malfunction because like she was crying over that moment. And uh you know, we got to dance together at the at the after party, and you just it was just so great. And I was so honored to have been part of her special day. And she's just the sweetest, loveliest woman. And and Elliot's so great. And we smoked cigars, and you know, it was it was great. Sick. It was great. It was a beautiful, beautiful wedding. So I was grateful for that. 